Hello, my dears. It's uh, me, Jackie, and welcome to the torture house. There's one thing. This game is from Spring Rabbit. I've been trying to play Spring Rabbit's game a few times in the channel. The problem is, every single time that I play a game from Spring Rabbit, after 20 to 30 minutes, the game will crash and erase my computer. My computer will crash, everything goes shut down, and then I lose all the recordings and everything. So I'm always scared of recording their games, even though their games are usually really good. So I'm scared. So I'm thinking about cutting, like, a, I don't know how long the game is, but I will cut around like 15, 20 minutes, I'll cut, and then I'll come back and try again, and I'll see what I'm gonna do, but... <laughs> God, I'm scared of this game. Anyway. Let's, let's just go. New game. It's so pixelated though. For best experience, we use headphones, play in the dark. I, I can't. Lock the doors and win. Why? Make sure you don't have anything locked with you. I don't have anything locked with me. Make sure no one is filming you without your consent. In September 1999, Victoria Atkins, a young uh, aspiring model, was traveling through Cook County, Texas, in search of a job opportunity when she suddenly disappeared. While it was initially believed she would simply become lost on the road, days passed without any sign of her. But what no one could imagine were the horrors of ultraviolence she would experience in a place that could easily be described as hell, the torture house. I saw somewhere that this game was based on real events. But I'm exhausted after this trip. I just want to go to my room and put my things away. My key has the number 107. Alright then, 107. And that's where we're going to go. You have a flashlight on you. Uh, I forgot your name already. Jessica? I really forgot your name. I'm so sorry. Warning! I can't read! Oh no. I guess watching Call Me Kevin excessively through the last, the last few days has been making, una making me unable to read. Like him. Okay, a hundred. I'm a hundred oh seven. Oh two, oh four, oh three, okay. Five, six, seven. That's my room. It's my room. I, I know. It's locked. Uh, you have a key. The key is in my pocket. Okay. The key is in your pocket. Ah, I have to press E. Use. Good. Can, can I get in now? Oh, I can push the door open with my face. I'm finally here. Where's the bathroom? I can't carry this backpack anymore. I mean, it's probably right right there, right? I should put my things away in the bathroom before checking the rooms. Okay. Let me see. This is the living room. Uh, maybe this is the room? There's something in the door. Cautions. Maintenance in progress. This room is isolated for maintenance. For your safety, please do not enter. It's locked. Well then. This can only be the bedroom. Oh, it is. What was that? Come on, show me again. Ah, put backpack. There you go. Pretty good. The backpack is done. That's it. Now I can finally read that letter. What letter? Collected letter. Dear Victoria, I hope this letter finds you well. How are things going? It's been a while since I heard from you, so I decided to send another letter. You're always in a different place all the time, so it's hard to know your exact address. In your last letter, you mentioned receiving a proposal from a magazine. I hope things are going, are going well. Just don't get discouraged. I know things aren't easy for you, girl, and how hard it is to find an opportunity for this type of work that isn't, you know, men's magazines. Your friends always ask about you. You should write to them, too. I always hear them telling others how you took your car and set off on your adventure to chase your dream of being a model like in Hollywood movies. 
No, I guess now I know why you don't write to them. I know you don't want to disappoint them. Mom and Dad are fine. Mom misses you and Dad doesn't talk much about you. You know how he disapproves of your idea, but he loves you. And I love you too, future Miss America. With love from your sister, Lauren. Oh, thanks Lauren. I miss you all. I've been on the road for like four hours. I have to take a shower. Oh yeah, for sure. How about we go outside and take a shower in the rain? No showers in the rain? Okay. Oh girl, this world is dangerous. This world is really dangerous. Door. Is it is it locked? Oh, no. I forgot that I have to push it with my face to make it work. Looking in the mirror makes, you, makes me nervous. Am I pretty enough? Will they like me? You're pretty. It's better for me not to put these things in my head. I know I'll manage. I hope you do, but I don't trust the mirror. I really don't trust the mirror. Alright, bath up. Let's take a shower. And stay away from the mirror, please. Like I said, I don't trust that mirror. Ah, put the water up. Nice and warm. Why is the water so dark? Is that normal? Or am I just really dirty? Maybe I'm just really dirty. Been in the road for four hours, you know? it's That's what happens when you're in the road for so long. You get really dirty. How long am I going to stay in the shower? Oh, there you go. I'm done. Good. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, a key. Okay. Why do I have a key? I need to get my clothes from my backpack. You definitely do. You're not going to empty it up. I don't need to take a shower again. No, but I mean, you could empty it up. Right, let me get dressed. I'm not going to try to check on things while I'm naked and only have a towel on me. No, don't tell me that the clothes are gone. What? Where are my clothes? I haven't... I can't have forgotten them. This can be happening. I'll buy something to wear tomorrow. I'll put this one in the wash. I think I can wear this for one more night. Oh, so we are putting the same clothes back again? Yep, I put the same clothes back again. That's a good excuse, I would say, to keep the clothes in. It's off. Doesn't look like it's <coughs> a power button. I need the remote control to turn it on. Crap, modern TV. <laughs> God damn it, this modern TVs. Ugh. Well, I have a key and there's that room that is completely locked. It's almost empty. I should stay here for more days than I expected, so I need to buy some things to eat. I'll think about it later. I still have some snacks in my backpack. So, what exactly are we doing? I know that we can try, probably, we can try to check this out. It's locked. Well, I have a key use oh oh a table with some tools all right and this is the tv remote why was the tv remote in here now what is this i have to be careful not to end up falling in this hole i guess what's up with this ladder just an old ladder Oh, you're not gonna even try to use the ladder in the hole and... Okay, nope, we have the... We have the remote, that's all we needed. I'm not going out, I suppose. Well, I can, but I don't see a reason for. So let's go back inside. Can I sit and watch TV now? Couch. I think I can. Um, I don't know what to do, I'm just sitting on the couch. All right. Hello? Who is it? Is this a, this a hotel, right? Hello? Who am I talking with? Oh, with nobody. Someone stuck a note on the door. 
Due to heavy rain, we need to isolate the parking garage to prevent flooding tonight. Everything will be back to normal by morning. Oh, so I cannot go to my car or anything? Is that what he means? I think that's what he means. Basically, I'm not allowed to go to my car again. Guess I lost my car forever. Alright, can I use the remote to uh, turn on the TV? Okay, maybe I need to be close to the TV. There you go! Texas, whatever. Let's just watch TV. It's relaxing. Wow! I'll give you my interpretation of the urban cowboy. Uh, it's a guy that drives a pickup truck. Oh no, I'm falling asleep. Gun rack in the back. That uh, usually works maybe in a chemical plant or uh, in a. Oh no, I'm good. Is that David Gold? No, it just looks like him. Oh, I think I fell asleep. I definitely fell asleep. Okay, completely passed out. Gone. I heard that. Hello? Oh. Damn, I must have fallen asleep. Right, at least you turn off the TV. And you got up by yourself. Okay, that's good, that's good. Now it's time to cut. I'll, uh, I'll stop the recording, save it up, and everything will be fine. Okay, at least my first 12 minutes of gameplay is completely saved. I hope it's fine. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I need food. Oh, someone's at the door again. What do you want? Ha! Huh. Nobody. Not this time. Oh, the doorknob must have jammed. I should go in. I shouldn't go in there anyway. Right, if you say so. Bathroom? Anybody hiding in there? No? Mirror? Okay, we're good. We're good. You know what? I'm going to bed. Oh my god! <laughs> oh! That was it! I was so nervous about saving it up and being sure that it wasn't going to break and in the end it was the shortest Spring Rabbit game that I've ever played. Holy shit! <laughs> Sharon Tate? Oh no, there's a bit more. My arms. I can't move them. Oh, maybe that was just the beginning. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Press E to break free. Oh no. Oh, I don't think I'm going to break free. Oh no, oh no. Oh sh No, that's it. Oh, she died. No, she's not dead. Okay. This is by far one of my biggest fears. The whole being buried alive and then drowning is like... Bro, what the fuck? Oh, I can say. Amateur videos depicting real torture and deaths recorded by the Manson family responsible for the murder of actress Sharon Tate in August 1969 were discovered. The tapes have been forwarded to the Los Angeles Police Department to be archived as evidence of the crimes. The murder of Sharon Tate, so there is from the time of um, not merely Manson, Charles Manson, a dusty old machine. I have no idea what this is for. Seems to have a chain making it work. I better not touch it while it's in motion. All 
Alright, so maybe something that I don't know what it is for yet. Well, thank you for the window. It's very lovely of you. And I know that you're filming me, because I can see the camera over there. That sucks. Yeah, I highly doubt that I can leave from here. Door. Oh my god, the door is open? Okay. Well, I don't think I'm going in here. Door. It's locked from the other side. And this one? Great, there was a hole at the door. Now I understand why the game kind of like makes you open the door with your face. Audition. All the spotlights are on you. Now you're an actress and your fans are eager to see you perform. Eyes are watching you from all directions. Leave this spectacle. Sometimes it's necessary to give your life for the theater. Complete your scene and you're one step closer to becoming an actress. Fail and nobody will miss a mediocre actress. Script. Alice chased the rabbit through the forest until she fell into its hole. She found herself in a room with a small door, but Alice wonders how she'll manage to get through it. It is a challenge she needs to solve. Ah, I see. Oh, you creepy bastard, you're watching me. Okay. And you're recording this whole thing. And one more time, you have that. Well, I can crouch, right? Oh, is that barbed wire? Okay, okay. Ow! Okay, I'm gonna die. Or not. Okay. Ooh, that's more difficult than it seems. Like I just said, a bit more difficult than it seems. Oh, I thought it was going to give me one more. Am I- how much health- oh, I have only two health. It is health? Painkillers. What is this? It seems to be a kind of painkiller. Well, good thing that we can probably try it, right? PE-237892 Experimental. Reduction in combat of physical and mental distress. Increasing serotonin and noradrenaline levels to combat mental distress and st stabilize the individual. Along with other substances rectified for mood stabilization and anxiety relief. Combats physical pain and aids in the healing and recovery of the individual. Sharpens the senses, bringing about a temporary ultra focus effect. Side effects organisms' rejection may cause hallucinations, numbness, and in the long term, significant loss of vocal cords, panic attacks, seizures, and psychosis. All oh, that's not good. I mean, we kind of need to take it in order to survive all the pain. I can save. <laughs> was attacked by a masked man armed with a knife. She hit the man in the eye with a pen knife and managed to escape alive. The suspect, standing at approximately 6 feet 5 inches tall, reportedly employs what the police believe to be a flashlight with a powerful beam to attract attention and disorient victims before fatally stabbing them. The most recent victim is Haley Palmer, a 19-year-old college student whose body was found in a creek last week. That sucks. So, more people are being... It's locked. What I'm getting... It's difficult to understand, because it's very... Very faint. This lock, uh, this lock is missing the outer part. I might be able to unlock it if I can reach inside. So, more people are basically being kidnapped. It's locked. Well, this is the only door left. Alright, this one is open. Oh my god, stop scaring me. I know you're watching. Jesus. Right from down there. That's perfect. That's fantastic. This one is locked. Oh, this doesn't look safe. I'm gonna die. The rabbit seemed restless, euphoric, frequently checking his watch as he ran through the valley of uncertainty. After crossing paths with Alice, his instinct was to run faster and faster. The more he ran, the more distorted the sound seemed. The more distorted his surrounding appeared, until in the blink of an eye, 
an obstacle appeared in his path. Only the rabbit's scream echoed and could be heard by Alice. Soon a lesson she had learned. When a fragile body has to run, it can only bring more obstacles. So you're telling me not to run? Why is it Oh! Oh, there was a thing behind me! I thought I was not supposed to run. What a waste of time. The death is, was insignificant. Well, I'm sorry. I tried my best here. Alright. You know what? I'm gonna take those painkillers. Okay, I have to run it. I can run because running, like I, eh, like I thought, running will make me fall. Okay, I think I see. Now walk and walk and walk and walk and walk and run. No. I thought I could run still on the bottom. It's fine. Oh, right. Okay, so it is how I thought. Just like, don't run. One, four, five, seven. And this door is locked forever. All right. But this, I think, has a note. No, there's a key. There's another piece of script is stuck in the door. Alice found herself trapped in that world, devoid of faith. The sky was falling. She looked all around, but her key had shattered into pieces around her. Her hand had been cut by the first fragment, leaving a blood stain followed by more intense pain from the second fragment that fell near the first one. Her escape was right in front of her. While she was consumed by hatred and suffocated by the fragments of her key that seemed to mock her situation. Was it delirium or just frenzy? Frenzy of madness, this sign from that place. Uh, oh, look. It looks like there's a code on the lock. Yeah, and there's... I need to be fast. I need to be very fast. Oh shit. Uh, 5714 and the key. A small key. It doesn't work. Uh, 4571 enter. Nope. Uh, 4, five, I don't know. 5714? 5714. Four. No. 41. Uh, no. 41. Seven five? No. That was the script and I missed the script and now I don't know the order. Uh oh wait. Can I use the key on this? No, I can't. Okay. I'm gonna die. I was paying attention on my cat that wanted to be petted and wasn't really paying attention on what I was reading. <laughs> ah, I get it. Okay, I need uh, I need paper. So, her hand had been cut by the first fragment, leaving the blood. So the first one is four. Followed by more intense pain from the second fragment that fell near the first one. That fell near the first one. So it's the wall right next to the four. I think that's a one. And then you have a seven on the other side. Her escape was right in front of her while she was consumed by hatred and suffocating by the fragments of her key that seemed to mock the situation. Was it delirium, just a frenzy of madness aside from that place? Her escape was right in front of her. Wait. So it's definitely four. One. I don't know now if it's going to be a five or a seven next. So I'm gonna put four, one. 4175 417 4175 Why was 4517? 451 I don't know. Oh, I'm on the other side. And there's the radio again. Okay, let's save that. Yeah, we already heard that one. It was the same as before. A box. 
Oh? Why do you have a switch? I don't know why you have a switch. And you are locked, and I have a key. Can I use that? No. Then you I cannot reach from the other side, so I think I can only use the switch. It's not working. Oh, okay, never mind then. The switch is not working. I already went through those doors. You I cannot reach. Oh, you're open again. Why can I go in here? That doesn't look like a place that I want to come in. Filing cabinets. Alright, there's nothing. Aha! A machinery room key. Okay. So I guess I can go downstairs for something. It's locked. Oh, but hey, I have I have a small key. Nice. What is that? A screwdriver? Good. Okay, a screwdriver. Nice. All right, I have a machinery key and a screwdriver. It's full of old papers and documents on it. I can't read much. This prob there's a photo of a girl tied up with a gun to her head. She looks devastated. There's another photo of a girl tied up in a tape around her arms and mouth. Why are those monsters doing this to me? I need to get out of this place. I don't know, man. Some people are just freaking sick. It's locked. Alright. I don't have a key for that. Shelf. Just some old papers. Okay. And this shelf? Just some old papers. And the camera is right there. Observing every step that I make. Right, I have a screwdriver and a key for a machinery, so I think I can go back? No, I cannot go- oh, no, I have to go back through here. But maybe I can reach this with the screwdriver. Ah, so then I don't need to go through that small door again. Okay, much better. Now I need to save up. I shouldn't have saved though, because if the game breaks, it means that I'll have to do everything again. Well, there's a camera right there. There's a wire mesh blocking the way. It looks like there's a camera on the other side. It does, doesn't it? That's the door that I- Oh, that's the door that I came in! With the hole. Is this the outside? I'm technically on the outside, but I don't... No, I'm not. There's just a lot of plants in here. Aha! Right. So once more we go back downstairs. And now I think I can use the key on this. An old dusty machine. I need all this for. Okay. Can I use the key for this? Well, what if I block it up with the screwdriver? Right. Now I have the chain. The screwdriver got stuck in the gear. No, that's not good. And uh, how about that key? Can I use it here? Apparently not. Machinery- oh, machinery room key. Not necessarily the machinery key. Okay. Oh. I got scared by the noise. Which one is the machinery room? Well, it might be this one. I suppose. Machinery room? Yep. Oh boy, everything is green in here. Why? A machine and another rusty machine. It's a very rusty. It seems like it hasn't been working for years. And this one? It doesn't seem to be broken. The chain is missing. <clears throat> no problem. I have a chain. There you go. Use it up. Perfect. Now it's working. Now that it's working, I suppose that the... Oh no. Oh no. Oh boy. Oh please. 
Okay, you know what? I'm gonna save and I'll cut. Alright. I cut, I'm back. We're gonna pull the switch and hope for the best. Yeah. Oh no. Oh, there he comes. Oh, listen. Sir. Sir. Sir, listen. Listen. You don't come after me. Woo! Running, 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 run around the rousey! Not yet, not yet, not yet. Run around the rousey. There we go. Huh. <sighs> okay. I'm safe, I'm safe, I'm safe, I'm good. I'm good, I'm safe. Good thing that that guy is just chasing me like very slowly and just slowly walking. <sighs> oh, I'm done. Scene complete. Ah. Score not available. To be continued. Thanks for playing. Did you enjoy it? I did. I did enjoy it. I'm also happy that the game did not break a single time. <laughs> Maybe I was a little bit paranoid in the considering that usually when I play Spring Rabbit's game it does break. Uh, so it, yeah, maybe a little to be too much that I kept cutting. I don't think it's Spring Rabbit's fault. I don't know if it's just my computer cannot handle it or what happens, but it's usually what happens. There was another game that I tried to play from them, something to do with a house in the woods. And the game was awesome and then by almost at the end of the game it broke. <laughs> it is so annoying. But this one, I liked it. I liked it a lot. So I'm very interested to know what's gonna come after that, because I really enjoyed it. I like Spring Rabbit's game. It's just, it, it's really the problem of crashing that scares me off of those games. But all things considered, great game, fantastic. I love the story, I love the radio. I, I feel like maybe the radio could be a little bit more higher up, so then you could hear what the guy is saying. Just so, just that, but other than that, I really liked it. I liked the puzzles, the puzzles were not that bad. The only one that I didn't really understand much was the numbers with the keys. Like the first two parts of the key was okay, and then the other two numbers... It felt like a try and error, like just switch up the numbers and see what you can do with them. But still, great game, really liked it, the torture house. So that's it. If you liked it, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel for more. I'm going to play tons of other games besides this one. And as usual, I hope you all have a happy ever after. And I'll see you on the next day. Bye-bye.